celebration of fun for everybody. Stuff going on in Mount Washington Valley. Well, Absolutely. and it's all happening right up the road yeah, at is. Theater in the Wood, Theater Trails in the, in the Wood. Trails in the Wood, Theater in the Wood, and the 100 Acre Wood. Let's, we've got the multifaceted, the 100 Acre Wood is the home of the Theater in the Wood and the 100 Acre Wood and the Believe in Books Literacy Foundation. Right, and yeah. you know, usually you say if you have good, you gotta have bad. You guys are just multifaceted good. All good. <laughs> so let's start Let's start with the literacy, literacy sure. thing. Yes, <laughs> um, the Believe in Books Literacy Foundation. Um, been 18 years now in Mount Washington Valley, and what we do is we have these literacy programs throughout northern New Hampshire, western Maine, where we visit uh, 50, 55 preschools. We come with uh, larger than life character. We read stories to the kids in the in the in their classrooms, and then every kid gets a brand new book. Um, and we do this all year round. My kid was a participant in this yeah. program, just brought home a book. I'm yeah. like, where did yeah. this come from? I'm like, oh, the library. He's like, no, I get to keep it. I'm like, what? Yeah, yeah. It's, it's a wonderful program that we do. It's one of the many literacy programs we do. We, we work with the hospitals and newborns. Mm. We have book bag programs where families get book bags over a period of time, over years, and gather collections. I mean, it's, uh, and it's all free. You know, That's it's all wonderful. put on by the... By the now, uh, what's so important about reading? Well, I think we, we all talk about it, but the data backs up that early literacy makes all the difference in the world for our children as they're getting older. Um, chances are you and I read when we were little, and we're read too. Mm -hmm. And um, it has everything to do with how we succeed in life in all facets. Well, I think it's, it's a nice thing too, because as a parent, it's one of my favorite times of the day, because it's quiet time, you know, and you really get to bond, not only over the reading, but it opens up a whole possibility oh, of conversations that just, you would never just have. Just the time you spend with your child mm -hmm. reading at night, um, that special time, which you can't replace with any other activity. Right, absolutely. Yeah. And the books, now that my 10-year-old's reading, He's reading The Hobbit yeah. and you know all these great series. Yeah. Uh, Harry Potter, of course, right. has opened a lot of doors right. for kids. Right. Um, and Percy Jackson, all these yeah. great series that now he's off and running. Yeah, I'm I same, can't tear him away now. Right, I, I have a 10-year-old also. This is a also. problem. Yes, <laughs> and the, the reading, we, we still read every night. Yeah. It's, it's wonderful. Yeah. It is a wonderful yeah. thing. So on the literacy side, doing great things. If people need more information, where can they um, check that Believeinbooks.org. Okay. Believeinbooks.org. So now we're going to switch it up a little bit. I mean, it's all connected, but we're going to switch it up a little bit yes. because you have some great entertainment. We Not do. only tonight, but you've had great entertainment. It opened up the facilities to some great groups, including yes, the have. Ice Festival. In including the Ice Festival. Uh, at the Theater in the Wood, which is located in the same uh, property, which I'll, I'll mention that it's two miles north of the Scenic Vista. Uh, so it's in Intervale. You just pass the Scenic Vista two miles past the scenic fist on your left, big blue sign, theater in the wood, that's where the theater is. You know, we were talking about, it's, it, a lot of people still don't realize where you guys are. And I think it's because it's a fast section of road. It is a fast section. Like they're, they're kind of looking forward straight yeah. away, you yeah. know, but yeah. if they slow down just a bit, just they're gonna be rewarded. <laughs> Look at our sign, come on and visit, come on to our show. Tonight we have a show. Huge. Uh, we have at 7.30 tonight, N-Train returns to the theater in the wood. Um, N-Train, rock, reggae, swamp, uh, dance, you dance it's so percussion. Much fun. These would, guys yeah. are, these guys are so much fun. Um, the way I put it is, we had a sweaty good time last time <laughs> yeah. they were here. I know. Uh, I was privileged <laughs> enough to go there, and it was uh, whose birthday was it? It was someone's big birthday, and of course they're going to celebrate with you guys at yeah. N Train yeah. because if you want to go dance, this band just has the best yeah. groove yeah. beat. Yeah, it's 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 such a groove, and they're so much fun. They're great to listen to. They're very it's a good musical, crowd too. and the crowd gets into it. Now the shows at seven thirty. Tickets are on sale. Okay. Um, at the door, we mm -hmm. doors open at seven. They're twenty five bucks. Okay. Um, BYOB, you can bring your own beverage. You do the math. <laughs> <laughs> we don't need to go to details, you but know, come on. <laughs> you can bring a little cooler, right. bring whatever, it's fermented so or not. Fun. Yeah. Bring a little picnic. Um, we have a beautiful 300 seats theater. Um, theater in the wood doesn't mean we're outside. It means we're in our uh, our beautiful, very <laughs> cozy uh, theater. There's no bad seats, and the acoustics right. are phenomenal. Right. Yeah. Okay, um, so entering tonight, and you tonight. said 7.30, doors open, tickets are available at the door at this point. You yeah. can sell out, though. So we can, we can. Definitely um, want to go a little early. I think, I think if folks stick around through our weather, we're going to have a, busy, a very busy night. Yeah, I, you know, I think the weather's going to be not so bad through tonight, though, yeah. so I think that's I think a good so. thing. I think, it, I think that's right. I think it's a slow storm. No reason yep. to not go out tonight. Absolutely. Definitely. I'm with you on that. End train's worth the effort it anyway. Um, okay, so let's switch hats once again and get to the cross-country skiing and snowshoe yeah. trails. We have, um, 
We've got 10 kilometers of cross country, walking, biking in the spring, summer. Uh, running. Beautiful running, be dog friendly, family friendly, kid friendly. Beautiful trail system all in our 100 acre wood. Um, where the, the theater is, where the trails are, where the believe in books, such all of us. A, um, I mean, I want to say I want to say quaint, but that means small to me. But it's not small. It's just such a nice feel back there. Yeah, I mean, it is. Yeah. It's quiet, yeah. and you're just out there, and you have like a little uh, lake pond that sometimes pond. you can see some yeah. wildlife yeah. at, yeah. and just it's it's a really Goes nice by system. the river. I mean, very it's, family friendly. It's a, just a beautiful. Um, it's. Tremendously affordable. I mean, three dollars a car load for the day, or ten dollars per car load for the week. Right. Um, if you want to become a member um, for fifty dollars, member of the Believe in Books Literacy Foundation, you get a year's pass to the trails. Amazing. And you're supporting our literacy efforts. So. Win-win. Win-win. Thank <laughs> yeah, you. I would uh, say. Yeah. I would so the, the trails, the trails are, and we groom them ourselves. We've got a yeah. you know, good groomer, the whole thing. It's just come on out, cross-country ski, snowshoe, walk, whatever. A.O. Lucy is just out there doing A.O. Everything. is out there, our, our leader. <laughs> say he's a machine out there because <laughs> he he's even gearing up. You know, maple season yeah. is coming up right around well, the corner. Well, that's right. Tomorrow is the, to plug the other uh, stuff going on, we've got the, the chocolate festival all throughout the valley. Now going, this is a self-guided tour, correct? Yep, self-guided tour into inn. We're also a stop, our sugar shack. We don't have enough going on. We have our sugar shack, which is our maple house. Um, which you were being be, sarcastic, weren't you? Yes, I was. <laughs> <laughs> um, our maple house, our sugar shack is open tomorrow, a stop on the chocolate festival. Now can people just stop at the sugar shack? They can or drive they up like, in yeah, their I'm car. Yeah, the chocolate festival, sure. <laughs> come on piggyback, you know, yeah. drag your kids from the, the trails. Bike in, well, I don't know if you're gonna bike tomorrow, yeah. but uh, come on in and we've got chocolate treats. We'll have a little tour of the Sugar Shack. Um, just fun. Is there a cost of, associated with that or is it? Yeah, when uh, you, you, you buy a pass for the, for, the sh for the chocolate tour and we're one of the stops along the. Okay, along can the, they do that at your place they, or do they have to do it at no, the they chamber? Do at the, at the um, Mount Washington Valley uh, uh, Ski Touring Association. Oh, at the oh yeah. okay, which is right down the road right. at Ragged Mountain. Right, exactly. Okay, good. So. But maple season is upon us. So and Sugar Shack is going to be open for the chocolate tour right. yet. Yes, and we're going to be open on weekends because we've started to tap the trees. And I mean, this, we're talking we labor. Being AO. We being AO. <laughs> we being AO. Um, our, our, our glorious uh, director. Um, tapping the trees, gathering the syrup, and then we take it to the Sugar Shack, boil it down. And we also sell our own maple sugar. So you can get that online at uh, believeinbooks.org or you can stop it at our office at the 100 When you say maple wood. sugar, you mean maple syrup? Um, ma maple syrup, okay. excuse me. Because okay. they do syrup. have the little treats as well. Well, we sell candy as well, but but mostly the, the maple syrup, syrup the yep. different bottles okay. and sizes of those. Wonderful. So, so right there on. from the property. So if yeah. you want a true New Hampshire maple syrup, there you go. Yeah. And when does that sort of all start flowing? It's usually late February, early okay. March, and goes until Mother Nature says it's over. Right, which is actually relatively quick. It's about a month. Yeah. So we need the cold um, nights, warm days. All right, to, we got to get on that then so because it's kind of warm right now. We had a stretch of that. <laughs> where, so that's got the trees going a little early and good. sap is running. Okay, so good. So just to recap, end train tonight, 730 doors open, $25 at the door, BYOB. Fantastic band! You got to go check them out, and you can find it all at your website. Uh, and you can actually click click over to hear some of their tunes. I think. Yeah, too. you can. Um, the website for the theater, theaterinthewood.org. Okay, and theater is E R, and it's not woods. It's just wood. wood. Right. So theaterinthewood.org. You got it. Okay, Jesse, did we get everything? I I think so. Just want to mention, um, we've got f f five concerts in March. <laughs> go to our website, theaterinthewood.org. So yeah, and. Come see us in March, every Saturday, 7.30. We're gonna be putting on a show. Wonderful. So come check it out. Good music, and just another point to put you on the spot. Do you guys rent that place out for weddings and stuff? We do. Um, the theater for weddings, uh, for people's events, for companies' okay. gatherings, for um, just about anything you wanna do. The Love theater it. is a perfect place. Wonderful.